Hello everyone, welcome back to No Man's Sky 2021. We're playing permadeath today. Uh, it's time for our freighter battle, and so today I'm going to bring you the basics of fighting for the freighter you want. And uh, we're going to do this uh, in the system where I got the S-Class freighter uh, that we uh, just got the other day. And uh, what happened was I, I uh, warped away from uh, the Mistress of Frost system, uh, Borjo, uh, because I was going to warp back to reset all of the, the mechanics and try and get the S-Class. Uh, but that's okay. I'll just build it into an S-Class. Uh, this came up, and I've been waiting for this to come up. Um, quite a number of people asked me uh, if I had made a video of winning the freighter, and I didn't. And the reason I didn't is because I had given up on the freighter and didn't think I was going to get it. Um, so I thought, you know what, the next freighter battle, I am going to teleport out to my uh, standby base, which is right next to the system uh, where the freighter uh, spawns, and uh, we'll warp in and I'll show you uh, how we did this. Uh, the first step is um, when you're coming up on that battle, when you've got three hours of playtime, save in every station before you leave so that when the uh, freighter battle starts, if you don't like the freighter that's in that battle, you can reload back to that prior station and warp to a different system and look at that freighter. And you keep doing that until you find the freighter you want. Uh, similarly, similarly, if you're getting a freighter that you found on Discord or on Reddit, or if you want to come get this one, um, you'll want to create a base in a nearby system, um, preferably one that doesn't have civilization. This is a red star system with uh, no race. And um, that way you can actually warp here uh, directly if you're in the neighborhood and not set off that freighter battle. Uh, or you can teleport here and uh, set off the freighter battle. So uh, what we're going to do, since we have the freighter selected, is we are going to warp to the system. You can see uh, Mistress of Frost is sitting right there on my landing pad. <laughs> I came directly here through the teleporter. And now we are going to warp to the system uh, where the freighter is. And that system is called Naukra. And uh, it's in Euclid Galaxy, uh, Alpha Beta Gamma, in the Gamma Quadrant, 712,000 light years from the center. Uh, I'll give you the glyphs for it, though. And uh, the glyphs are also on the multi-tool video. There's also a multi-tool in this system. Um, a nice looking experimental with a red decal on it. A blue, uh, blue experimental. So we're going to warp right in. Someday today. Sometime. Sometime. There is our freighter. And uh, if you don't know if you can, if you're going to want the freighter, you can fly right up to it. Don't engage the enemy at all. Uh, take a look at the freighter, see if you like it, and then you're going to go to the space station. So before you engage the enemy, even if they're shooting at you, you're going to want to go to the space station so that we can make an auto save. Anytime now. Unfortunately, you can't engage your pulse engines because there's a battle going on. So even if you are, you know, pretty far away, um, you're going to have to fly there. So we're going to get out and make a save. You can see the battle is coming right up to the space station. We can stand here for two minutes and let the NPCs kill all of the pirates. But on the next battle, we're going to have to fight. So let's go fight the battle. You'll notice as we reload uh, that the ship is going to move around. 
There goes one. All the fighters are over by the space station because they were chasing me around. Alrighty. Let's go see those beautiful guns firing off. Pretty awesome. We'll wait for this other guy to come in. See if we can hit that one in the meantime. Looks like I missed him. <laughs> Let's go get him. There we go. As soon as we can see him, we can fire. Try to take them out before the NPCs get there because rockets separate and they uh, you sometimes hit NPCs with them. Alrighty. Once the ships are defeated, uh, the uh, freighter will turn off its alarms and stop firing. When you land on a freighter that doesn't belong to you, an NPC freighter specifically, uh, it does not create an autosave. So as you can see, there's no save there. All you have to do is get out of your ship and scan the hull. And it, oh my God, right away. And it'll tell you that it's a, in this case, an A33 and nine. A33 and nine is not what we want. We don't fight repeated battles for an A-class ship. Um, there's nothing at all wrong with taking an A-class ship, um, but if you're fighting for the S-class, you reload on, reload on an A. So we'll reload, and this will take us back to the space station of Nakra. In complete silence, because I didn't restart my game. <laughs> There we go, now we're back on the space station. Uh, the battle is ongoing. If we look around, you can see that the freighter has moved. It's now above and behind the space station. And we just take right off. I'm gonna go right back over to the freighter. Start identifying the enemy positions and start the fight. Too close for rockets. <laughs> As you can see, my rockets are pretty killer. Go point blank range. <laughs> guy is completely surrounded by NPC ships, so we're going to let him go past. There we go. He is dead. And we can land. There's uh, two things of major importance that you do not want to hit on that freighter, or any freighter in the system during this battle, and that is the cargo pods and the guns. That will alert the sentinels. A32 and nine, this is going better than when I fought for it. Jeez. <laughs> uh, there's two things that you can do if you hit the freighter. One is to reload immediately. The other is apparently you can land on the space station uh, and get out of your ship, which will cool the jets of the Sentinels, and go back and land on the freighter that you were fighting for. I think that you need to complete the battle first, even with the Sentinels in the air. All right. Let's go fight it again. She is up there. It's sort of
sort of see, there's one over there. There's one in front of the ship. And there's a couple on the sides here. Being careful not to hit the guns. Being shot at. Listen, dude. Get out of there. <laughs> we ended up on the bottom of the ship that time. Now, obviously, I'm not seriously fighting for this because I already won the S-Class ship. But I did want to share this with you uh, and show you uh, how this is possible. You don't have to accept just what's handed to you. And if it's your first freighter, there comes the C-classes. If it's your first freighter, uh, that freighter will be free. We're going to reload again. And we'll be back on the space station. Good grief. Uh, there's one other thing. Um, let's say you fought this battle, but you gotta go. You can't stay. You can't keep fighting the battle for whatever reason. You're tired, it's been too long, or you have to go to work, or whatever. Um, you can also quit your game. I just hit quit to, to mode select just to save some time. But you can quit all the way to desktop. And you could start your game back up. We were 123 hours. <laughs> Moving right along. <laughs> so you can quit out of your game. Uh, as long as you stay at that space station, don't warp away. Because warping away is going to end the battle. And that is blinding. HG, come on, fix it. Uh, as you can hear, we still have music. We still have a freighter battle going on. There it is up there. And I actually had to do this. I fought this battle uh, over two days. And then you can just go right back to fighting it. I uh, shut my game down uh, for uh, all night and came right back to it. One down. You just keep flying away. Ah! He's way too close to that pod for me to fire rockets. <laughs> we'll just wait for him to clear the deck. This is a really cool ship to watch in battle. Uh, I showed you all when I got the ship. Uh, I let hostiles attack her. And they were after me, but I let them shoot my ship. And uh, that was enough to get her guns going. <laughs> Look at this nice fighter that I, I also bought. That's the yellow fighter. <laughs> so this is a beautiful ship, and uh, I am super proud of her. Um, it was a lot of work to get her, but it was completely worth it. <laughs> uh, another thing that you can do is you can get paid uh, 
but if you do, when you reload to the space station, you're going to lose what you get paid. Uh, just quickly, this is a B-31 and 8. Uh, if you go up here and you get paid, um, like I said, reloading is going to take away that payment. So if you're just fighting a freighter battle and leaving, um, then there's no reason to do this. But you can talk to him, and um, I'm going to be very careful here. <laughs> and you can request payment instead, and you will get exactly that. 285 chromatic metal. <laughs> we'll go ahead and reload. <laughs> and that chromatic metal is gone. But I have like 2,000, so. <laughs> As a second freighter, she didn't cost very much money because I'd already been improving my A class freighter. And I think she was 44 slots uh, when I gave up gave her up um, the magic bus <laughs> uh, now all we need is a name uh, for our s-class freighter and I like this line um, that I've been on with uh, the 70s uh, rock music uh, the sort of iconic names of 70s rock music <laughs> We were just at Borjo Station getting uh, uh, Mistress of Frost. And uh, where was I going? I forget now. There we'll go. We'll go back to the capital in Eisentown. If you... Uh, if you teleport away like this, before you make a save, if you reload, it will take you back to the station where the battle is. Um, but you should stay there until you get the ship you want. Um, you can also fly around and look for a different ship, uh, but you do need to do that before you make the save in the space station where the battle is. But we are going to reload. If it'll let me out of my ship, it'll be a miracle. Can I please get out of my ship? Please? Thank you. <laughs> All right. We're back in the Eisentam capital. And we'll uh, wait for this system fleet to come in. And there's our beautiful freighter. Good grief, a lot of freezeriness going on. <laughs> See, it's the same ship, SV-9, Idericon. I hate that name. It's terrible. I can't call this the Magic Bus. We have to come up with a new name. <laughs> and uh, I'll just show you quickly that uh, yellow fighter uh, that was in the battle. Uh, I picked this up in the space station when uh, lava first took me to Naukra. Osuku of abstraction. And um, we are just starting to build her. There's our brand new Mistress of Frost. We got to build her up. And we're not quite finished uh, building up uh, Miss Molly here. So we have that to do. Where's Guard Depot? Excuse me, you look like a Viking. Will you please get your ugly ship off my freighter? Thanks. <laughs> All right, you guys. Uh, I just wanted to take you through that mechanic of fighting uh, freighter battles. Uh, I know this is a super short video, but uh, 33 minutes of fighting freighter battles is not something 
uh, that I'm interested in doing today. <laughs> I just went through this. <laughs> but I want to thank you all so much for coming along. Uh, please uh, click the like button so that more people will see this video. And um, if you have any questions about fighting freighter battles, please feel free to put that, uh, put that down in the comment section. Uh, if I don't know the answer, somebody will, and I will get them to answer you directly. Um, and uh, if you have any suggestions for different ways of fighting freighter battles or for finding freighters, please also put that down in the comment section. Thank you all again so much for coming along. We will see you tomorrow. Have a great day.